Hello and welcome to Fan Park Live. Arsenal winning 3-0 at the moment. Are those moments left to go? Um, and the dog and duck have just missed the penalty, so we've heard. We're actually just watching the playback of that right now. <laughs> Always slightly behind on YouTube, as you save know. Dab, save um, dab, um, save obviously, I'm joined dab, by Ty dab. and Paul. Right. They're, they're engrossed this in the save. game right now. Save oh, that! Saved by the spinner. Well, Arsenal save. nearly conceded to a Sunday league side, <laughs> Ty. There we well, go. I never called them a Sunday league side, that's for <laughs> sure. <laughs> Listen, remember, we are powered and sponsored by the One Football app. We will be using it to review the game, looking at some of the statistics. Make sure you go and download that. The information is in the description below. But of course, Ty and Claw are here with me this evening to take your calls. Speak to them about tonight's game, of course. Arsenal's chances of winning the Europa League. I know Wenger's going to come up in the conversation with both of these two men here. But any questions mm -hmm. you want to pose to them, you can do. I've already asked Ty one. I know he wears all Arsenal clothing on match days. And he has confirmed to me that the underpants are Arsenal as well. Boxer shorts. Which, boxer shorts, sorry. Not <laughs> underpants. He, 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 he's quite clear I... on that. <laughs> but that's amazing. They dedicated everything is Arsenal. On a match day. On a match day and I'm, so, yeah, yeah. I'm really happy to meet this guy. Because I, so I've asked this question. Well. I know we were saying. But he's real. And he's passionate for his club. He, 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 we're going to go into some of that a little bit later. Um, injury time is now up. Danny Abel Welbeck's just running the ball about. Is that Welbeck still on the pitch? That is... Or is that that? Is, that's Danny or Eddie. Oh, there we go. Right. That's really small. We are. That's it. End of the game. Right. Happy with the result called. Ah, it's a good... <laughs> we're, through, we're, we're through now. So, um, next week, um, be just academic. But um, we're through. That's the main thing. Uh, we were not, not, as I said before, we're not in a, uh, we're in a no-win situation, whatever the yep. score. Would There's Robbie. Tonight. Sorry to interrupt. And, <laughs> and um, it's comfortable tonight. It was very comfortable. Yeah. Um, they were poor. The other side as well. They're a very poor team. I've, I don't think I've seen a worse team in, in European football, to be honest with you. How, how long do you clap for after the game? You clapped um, every substitute on and off. He's until <laughs> the guy, play, he loves I, his club. Until the players go off. Basically. Okay, that's good. Is that you do that when you're at the games, home and away as well? Absolutely. Always clap. Is Absolutely. that why you sometimes see some of the some of the gooners you we see on camera can be quite frustrated when you get a poor result and um, none of the fans come up to applaud you guys for the travelling and for the money you put in? Is that why sometimes you can find that a bit disrespectful from them? Um, yeah, possibly. I think sometimes it, 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 it's a it's a it's a hard one because if we have a bad result, they come up. And we'll be not me personally. We'll be slagging them off. But if we don't, if they don't come up now, we will say, "Oh, when did they come up?" Yeah, I can you know. see why the players don't come. So it's a, it's it's a, it's, it's a catch twenty two for the players. They Obviously, fall down and they feel that they, they exactly. Yeah. I think they also think they have got no right to be clapped off anyway. Well, I, as well. Well, well, I, I don't, maybe that's why they do go off. But I mean, at the end of the day, they're, they're yeah, they're paid professionals. Fair enough. But at the end of the day, yeah, they're paid professionals. But I'd put it like this: it's always an education watching my club. Always, mm. and whatever happens, however good, however bad, it's always great. I never see it as a waste oh, of it's time. Definitely an education to watch actually. our club. Yeah, absolutely, <laughs> absolutely, and an, an, an invincible education. Did I say that? An invincible education. Oh, but yeah. anyway, this is not an invincible channel. education. Was Did that I say that? Channel? An invincible education. Yeah, history channel. Yeah, and we all know about history, don't we? Cool. We're going to hear much, much more from these two as the night goes on. But we want your phone calls. You, the fans out there, are the most important people. We've got a call coming go. through right now. We'll give you the numbers up on the screen right now as well. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name and what team do you support? Arsenal. Uh, my name's Yusuf. Yusuf, the Arsenal fan. How are you feeling this evening after that wonderful 3-0 victory? <laughs> right, Yusuf. Oh, I'm, hi, Yusuf. Uh, hi, I'm, I'm, feeling, uh, I'm feeling great. Um, I, like, we needed this after the Tottenham game. Uh, Tom game to be uh, quite honest and uh, yeah hopefully we can move on from here yeah hopefully hopefully and uh, look uh, disappointing result in the North London derby derby at the weekend um, when we look at this competition though the Europa League as an Arsenal fan do you think there's a good chance that your boys can, can lift this trophy and, and find their way back into the Champions League that way um I, I'm, I'm hoping so. Like to be honest, after the defeat at Tottenham, like many Arsenal fans have said, um, the Europa League is probably our best hope of getting back into the Champions League. Um, but I mean, we've got some tough teams. Uh, I don't think anyone should be assuming like uh, uh, assuming that we're going to win the whole thing just because of this. But um, I mean, I, I, I this definitely motivates me to think that we have a chance. But I mean, we've got teams like Napoli and I believe like Atletico Madrid in this competition as well. Like. 
we we still got some uh, some hurdles ahead of us but mm. you know i'm 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 hoping i'm hoping that uh, we can pull something out like we have done sometimes in the past i wouldn't take too much into tonight's game one way or the other though but we're going to have tougher tests and we'll we'll have to step it up as well which we will do and um, it'll be interesting. oh yeah absolutely completely agree with with that uh, like i i i i'm not, i'm one of I'm actually very much, very, very much like Claude, not very much like Ty at all. Like Ty is very much the optimist. I'm like Claude. I'm, 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 I'm after games like these, I, I really, I, 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 I take a step back and I think, okay, what can we take from this game and what can we improve on? And um, we, and should we just, we should we completely turn around? Is this big enough? Is this a big enough team for us to completely forget about like past? results and move on um i i'm not sure if the team is big enough for us to completely forget about the tottenham game but yeah um, also I think tonight the competition sorry. Sorry. also tonight i mean we there was there was um they created a few chances and a, a better team might have put them away so yeah i can understand i can understand yeah but a better, a better team we would have played better yeah, isn't I, it mm-hmm. we would have played better if it was a better team that's what i think anyway mate really appreciate your call thanks very much you thank too. you very much mate Bye. Please. Take care. Oh, okay, mate. Wonderful oh, articulate yeah. call there, put his points oh, of view across oh, brilliantly. Yeah. Another call straight coming in. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name and who do you support? Hi, my name's Mo and I'm an Arsenal fan. Hello, Hello mate. Mo. Uh, basically, I just want to get a couple of stuff off my chest. I really do think that this Arsenal team is not good enough to win Europa League. Why is that? Uh, I think we're going to struggle. Number one, we have no natural wingers. Mickey and Ozil are not wingers, they're both creative players. Yeah. Number two, mm-hmm. uh, we have no striker. Danny Wolbeck is meant to be our striker, and he only has one shot on target today. Yeah, but to like, be f- I, yeah, go. On. I think no. Like to be fair, like uh, the pitch, the pitch didn't help him. But however, I think against a better team like Atletico Madrid, uh, Napoli, Lazio, I think we would have struggled today. Hopefully, though, we'll have a few players back. back yeah. But I, I do, I do agree with a lot of what you're saying. I don't. I think we're gonna we're gonna have a bigger test to come on. It's going to be yeah. an uphill task to win this Europa League. Yeah. Do, do you sort of yeah. look at it like there are some... When you look at Atletico, uh, Napoli, these teams... And Arsenal Arsenal should be in the same breath as them. They are Champions League teams yeah, playing really? in the Europa League. This year. Man, look, I'm a Man United fan, we know this. Mm. There wasn't anybody that good in the tournament last year when we won it. So it is a much more difficult... <laughs> yeah. t- it is a difficult task for Arsenal compared to Man yeah. United last year, no doubt. Mm. Um, yeah, yeah, no doubt. Having said that, Terry, but even the Champions League this year, there's some poor teams in that as well. But are they, are they poor? Are they very Liverpool? poor teams. I know, I know Liverpool destroyed Porto last night, but come on. Let's... Yeah, but yeah, exactly. Come Napoli, teams, Napoli for me are better. Napoli for better, well, better than Porto. Basel. Uh, yeah, sport, but I agree. Some really poor teams. And there's also some yeah, yeah, teams I agree with you, Claude. I do uh, think. I really yeah, believe in the Champions League. An English team has got a good chance this year. Actually. Really? Yeah. What? Well, getting better? Just joking. Well, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm only joking. I'm only joking. <laughs> well, I don't. If, well, I'm sorry. I know we're talking about the Europa League, but I, I can't see an English team winning it. Yeah, me too. I can't see. An I can't English because team Barcelona, Real Madrid, PSG, the, the the teams that they got. If if I was honest, I would say the team that looked best equipped attacking wise to win it personally is Man United even Juve Tottenham nearly got a result there yeah no, but don't worry when they come back to Wembley he could <laughs> he, he will score a hat-trick in the first three seconds don't worry about that <laughs> I hope I hope there we go mate really do appreciate thank your you call much, thank folks. you there's no realism in this studio see you later of course there is it should all be gloom and doom isn't it Jesus. it should all be gloom and doom isn't it Jesus we're going to put the one football app up you come out with some crap you do I'm sorry crap you well, if, I, if I remember that's crap. what you was doing in the toilet a minute ago isn't it what's that <laughs> Why were you watching him take a dump? I was watching. Then how do you know that's what he was because doing? Because that's what he's talking about, isn't it? I mean, you can only oh. talk about... You do come out with some. Ex- exclusive. Ty watches Claw go to the toilet. Don't watch him in the toilet at all. But... Talk about through the keyhole. He- <laughs> <laughs> through the keyhole. What? You would know, wouldn't you? Hello, right. welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name? Hello? Hi, ben, mate. How are you? Hello, Ben. I'm very all right, good. All right, Ben. Who do you support? Uh, um... Calling to talk to Claude about... Uh, Who's your team, Ben? Sorry. Play. Who's your team, Ben? Sorry. I beg your pardon? Who's your team? I support, I support Liverpool. Okay, okay. all right, cool. Yeah, cool. yeah but I, I'm interested in Arsenal as well. Um, just talking, possibly, 
if you guys don't win the Europa League this year, what do you reckon your best avenue or, or what do you guys need to do to get back into the Champions League next year? Pray. <laughs> um, <laughs> my gosh. <laughs> Um, is it, is it well, I mean, it's going to be a struggle to get top four unless the, the, we've got to expect two teams now to collapse between an uh, eight point lead. The one has got an eight, one has got a seven point lead. For one team to do it is, is hard enough, but for two teams, it's going to be de- desperately hard. So I think the only way we are going to do it is if we win the Europa League. And if, I've got a feeling we're going to be in this shit competition again next season. I bet you have time. Well, I, don't, I, I, agree. I, don't... I agree, but I, I'm talking about beyond next season. Oh, oh no, I'm oh, sorry, but beyond uh, next season. I'm oh, sorry, I thought you meant for next season. Sorry. What, for the... No, no I, yeah, I mean as in, as in improving next season well, to possibly being a top four team again. Well, if, 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 well, this, if well, this manager stays in charge, I, don't think, I think we'll have another uh, disaster season next season well, as well. I, 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 well, I agree. That's why I have to talk to you, not not Kai. Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course. But then, but then I'm here, and I will, I will, I will, I will, I will, I will answer your thing. You're saying that um, Champions League again? Didn't we? Weren't we in the Champions League for twenty years, or is that just a dream? Yeah, you were. Oh, okay, then. So then, yeah, when you, you no, okay, so when when you say that, you can't say that. You can't say that a Champions League again. Like we, it's only last season we went in the Champions League, so we've had twenty years. I don't yeah. think. No disrespect to you, but Liverpool have have had Liverpool, have Liverpool had twenty years straight in the Champions League. No, we haven't. Oh, we okay. Have look at the cameras when you're talking. Look at them. Look at them beep. Okay, <laughs> so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So then if you're you're saying that. Are you saying now that Liverpool are now a Champions League team regular and we're not? Is that what you're trying to tell us? No, no, no. no I'm not at all. I'm just saying. I think to. To attract these big players in the future, yeah. why are they going to choose Arsenal over a Man City or, or yeah, good point, great Tottenham point. Well, point. Well, I mean, well, if I was a player, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be joining Arsenal. Yeah, well, you, well, you, well, but well, you're saying that haven't we attracted um, Pierre Aubameyang and Henrik Mkhitaryan? Yeah, and you've just okay. So we've told, so we can attract. So let, we, let him, let him uh, answer, let him answer, let him answer. Go on, sorry, go on. It looks well. I watched. A lot of the game, and, and yeah. for some of the game, that that pub team from Switzerland was Boston. Boston, yeah, they're Boston, but they lost three 0 So that's not over here all day, is it? Yeah, but when you guys come up against maybe Athletic Madrid, yeah, yeah but we're not like, going to play like that. Good. Yeah, no, but the thing is, you know, we're not going to play like that. When we play Atletico Madrid, it's going to be a different performance, isn't it? We can afford to play like this. Well, I'm not like saying Saturday. it's right. Huh? What well, like Saturday? Well, Tottenham, the the, the 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 great bastions of the Champions League, Tottenham, yeah. Tottenham, oh. who, we, who we buried yeah, that which two could, home. We could have lost about three or four nil. In and here. Tottenham could have lost ten nil to gentlemen, us. Gentlemen, 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 well, mate, really do appreciate Thanks you much. calling Thank in you a fan much. park live. Thank, um, Thank you very much, sir. Nice call. Thank Cheers. You. Uh, look, great call and great points. It drummed up obviously a lot of debate between uh, between yourselves. Mm. Uh, do you do you honestly think? Look, I, look, I get you're going to point back at him, the Liverpool side of things. No, but no, no, but you, uh, yeah. Arsenal right now, mm. without winning the Europa League, you mm. are some way off getting into the top four. Absolutely. I know you've signed Pierre. I know you've got Mkhitaryan. Mm-hmm. But it looks unlikely right now to, to a lot of people that, that, that are not as positive as you, if, if yeah, I'm going to be polite, that you're going to get back into it. The, qu- yeah, question, the last question actually is, Ty, mm. how do you get back in it the year after? Well, we, we'll wait to see that happens. But no, but what would you do? Let me put it to you. So if you don't make it this year, you don't win this competition, yeah. what would you do if you were in and charge? we don't get up in the top four. Yeah, so what would you do to get you back back in the Champions League the year after? What would you personally do? Well, I don't know. Because the thing is, he's talking about, like, I've got to see at the end of the season. Mm. Because see, football can change in a week. So I'm not prepared now. To speculate what's going to happen at the end of the season. When the season comes, then I can take. I can't. I can't say what's going to happen in the future. But you must see the holes that within Arsenal's team. Yeah, you, I'll see. You, most fans would look at their own team and say, right, we need new defenders. We need to play free at the back. We need to. Uh, we need new manager. They could, there's a number of things that makes the team dysfunctional. You must watch it and see those. As much as you, support, you can love Wenger, you can support him. I but you might. Yeah, I know I you do. Well. But you must see holes within your team. Otherwise, you but wouldn't be where you are in the league. Absolutely. But the thing that there's, there's holes in every team. Only holy holes that are not in the team at the moment. It's Manchester City. So everyone has got something that they can improve on. Of course they have. What I think is that we possibly need some defenders and midfielders. But cool. I'm not going to write the season off yet. Great. Because that's, that, that to me is negative. Cool. We, also need to back we are just about to... Uh, we're going to do the One Football app. We're going to get it up on the screen once my phone connects to the app. And I'm going to make sure I don't reveal anybody's phone numbers, which has happened 
before. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 we are going to come on to DT later because I want to talk to. Um, yeah, we are going to talk about that. So we're going to put the. Sta- we're going to look at the game now. We obviously see the three 0 victory. What we want to do, we're going to take a few of the player ratings. But on this app, what you can do is vote for your man of the match. The votes have already been cast. Ozil was voted man of the match. Uh, yeah. Over 3,800 votes. Next okay. second was Henrik Mkhitaryan on 600 votes. So it shows well done, it? heavily well weighed, heavily yeah. weighed towards him. Who would be your standout performer today, Claude, for Arsenal? I thought Mike Maitland Niles had a good game. I'm surprised he's not up there. I'm Maitland Niles. Well, whatever. No, no Maitland Niles. Not Maitland, Miles. No, I said Maitland, Maitland Niles. You said what? No, you said Maitland I said, Miles. Listen you properly. said Maitland. Did you hear what Open Lumos, your You ears. said Maitland Miles. Said Lumos, Maitland what did you say? Maitland Niles or Maitland Miles? Said Maitland Miles. Thank you very much. Do you know something? You thank you, you very much. My mum and dad argued a lot when I was a kid, and you are bringing back some mental scars of mine. They're very deep. But I've been burying these for fifteen years, and I'm, I might start crying. <laughs> this well, is sorry. great. I love these it's, two. It's tears of joy. So who would you, who would you uh, tie vote as your your man of the match today? <coughs> Excuse me. That's that's the that's coughing off the lights from Claude. Um, sorry. I'm sorry. Um, after listening to the playback, it was Maitland Miles. Thank you very much, Ross, as well. <laughs> Right, sorry. So as I was saying, um, I, I, yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd go with Mesut. Mesut Ozil will be your man of the match yeah, today. Yeah, We're going to look at some of the stats as well while we keep this up on the screen. 60% of the ball to Arsenal. You expected that, right? Oh, to be that kind of ball. I expected more, more yeah, exactly. So how many shots? We'll put this out. How many shots do you think they had? At your goal tonight, who, this pub team. Who, this, well, I didn't call him a pub team. I, I call him a pub team. I don't. Eight or nine. In here. I'd say. T- I'd say twelve. Ten. 10 attempts. So the, the, one of the previous callers mentioned that. Like, and they missed the penalty. I know you, yeah, and they missed the penalty as well. <laughs> Is that not, do you, I know you're giggling, but do you think, Ty, that's a, a sign that you just took it too easy in that absolutely, game? Absolutely. And you, but you, you say you wouldn't, if you were playing Napoli, you wouldn't concede that many we chances. Could've, we couldn't be, <laughs> if we conceded like that Napoli, we could be out of the tie in minutes. So no. Oh, we conceded no, chances no, against Spurs. No we? pun intended. Yeah, well, we battered t- Tottenham at Emirates, did we not? But that doesn't matter. Yeah, but doesn't no, no, matter. So, no, but you're I'm saying that. Are we not playing away Napoli from home? home? Away we... from home, it's we two get legs. But the it's question legs, is, the question is, if you if you leak that many opportunities yeah, to a better exactly. side, does that not worry you as an Arsenal fan? Not really, not really, because the thing is that this season, oh. apart from Manchester United, we've got we've we've got one defeat at home, and we've turned up against the big teams. So no, he doesn't really. Not he away doesn't from really home. Not is away it, from home. Hold on, is it not two legs? Oh my God, oh. Is it not two legs? It's not two legs. It is, yes, you are right. Well, oh, okay then. So we're going to play away and we're going to play at home, aren't we? Did we not play Chelsea? Well, when we've lost and four nil away nil? from home. But how do you, we what if we win? What, home, so what if we win four nil then? What if we win four nil then? What if? Yeah, cause yeah, what if? Yeah, but yeah, no. But hold on. Let me say what you just said. If we're four nil down, I said to you, if we're falling up, but it's all right to be four nil down, but it's not all, all right, right to be falling up. My aunt had balls to be my uncle. Yeah, okay, <laughs> that, that, that old one. And 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 if mate, if, if Aisley's name was Miles, it wouldn't be Niles, would it? <laughs> <laughs> right <laughs> swiftly moving on right. so there's some of the stats for you as well today you can see them on the screen make sure you go and download the one football <laughs> app it's massively important to us that you do that and the best part about it unlike most things in life it's free i mean completely free you ain't got to pay niente so make sure you go and download that for us that'd be amazing you can check out all the stats in there Jesus, they they completed five hundred and twenty-seven passes against you as well. Who that too? Yeah, yeah, we really. They literally. Well, maybe, maybe the, the artificial pitch helped them a little bit, but there yeah, we go. The free but three 0 victory. That's all that that's really all that matters actually. at the end of the day. The stats are there. They're there to be looked into. I personally think there's still a slight issue and concern with conceding that many opportunities oh, to, a, to a team that's that poor. That would make if, you, I, if you, my team did that, you, I would be worried moving forward. I know. I'd be worried if we lost. The cracks are covered by beating Austin Stoes or whatever they are. Oh no, no. Of course not. Mm. The cracks are covered by not beating Chelsea either, isn't it? Or not beating Tottenham, isn't it? The cracks are not covered then, are they? <laughs> no, are they? They're I not covered then, are they? Can we get the phone put back up on the screen? Because we've got a couple of questions that were sent into us earlier. So we're going to get this up. Uh, you'll see my Twitter feed up there. So this was sent in by ex-Arsenal and Everton player. Kevin. No Kevin, right, Kevin. Kevin Campbell. Super Kev. Super, Super yeah, Kev. Thank great you very much, I will Kevin. say, if he is watching, uh, I'm assuming he is, absolute fantastic player. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Kevin. No, the phone's Appreciate not black. The question. Should, I'll reconnect it again. We're going to reconnect the phone now. It's up on the screen. You'll see that. There we go. You'll be able to see the tweet now. So what he says, and I'll pose this question to Claude first, and I'll come to yeah. Ty second. Yeah. He says, Arsenal are currently on the slide. Um, there seems to be little effort to address the team's obvious issues. Mm. So, A, uh, what needs to be done? And B, how long do you um, think it will take for Arsenal to mount a serious title challenge? 
What needs to be done? First of all, uh, what needs to be done is au revoir, Mr. Wenger. Yeah, predictable. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> and then I think it will, I'll, I feel sorry for the next manager that comes in because he's going to take time. He's going to have to change everything up. So, so, how, so, so when you look at this as a gooner, mm. lifelong gooner, how many years do you think it will be until you are up well, there fighting for a title again? It could take us one, two years. But the way we, if we keep our arsenal, awesome, it could take even longer, uh, as far as I'm concerned. You know what I'm saying? It's, yeah. uh, it's going to be difficult. Um, the new manager is going to have to come in and change everything, to change the attitude. The mental the mental side of the, the team is all wrong. Everything's wrong at the moment. Yeah. And, and, and we, need, we, need, sorry. We, need, we need, we really do need a lot of, uh, for me, about two or three defenders. I think we need a proper, and I mean a proper defensive midfielder, strong midfielder, you know, proper defensive midfielder. And that's that's what we need. We need all all that to go forward. Otherwise, yeah. we're not going forward. And how about yourself? So, firstly, like from your point of view, I mean, we've we've kind of asked you that question already. You, you yeah. are on the slide. Yeah. And everybody is like I said. Everybody is apart from Man City this season. So well, that's, 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 new. that's not strictly true. Well, who who is on the up this season? Who's apart on the from up? Man City. Yeah. Spurs. From from last year to this year. Spurs. Spurs. From la so last yeah. year to this year, Man yeah. United. But so Man United are what second? Yes, but so they've gone from like fifth to second. That's a okay. jump. But they're still not champions is it okay but let's forget about other teams for a moment let's concentrate yeah. on your team arsenal okay okay so they're on the they're, they're on the slide we know that yeah what needs to be done to stop that from happening what need well, what, what does venga you you want venga in okay we know that so what does, what does venga need to do in your eyes to get you back up challenging for that title and how long until your genuine title contenders well, again well first of all i don't don't, I don't sit on the fence time <laughs> i don't agree with with cloud everything's not wrong because if everything was wrong we wouldn't be facing Manchester city in the carabao cup would we no, we title, don't have a Premier wrong. League come title on, challenge. No, come on, no, answer no, the question. Yeah, no, but Stop deflecting. No, You're like Hillary on. Clinton here. Come on. Come on. No, but hold on, hold on. Hold on. Come on. We are 27 <laughs> points behind. 27. <laughs> Let that sink in, mate. 20, 27 20, points. And 27. You're saying, no, it's nothing's going wrong. I Six said, in the league. But you're, but you're we're heading listening. for our lowest points total but you're not ever. Listening, but you're not listening. And you're, you're not saying listening. that we're not you going downhill. You are not listening. What are you talking about? Are you talking about? Listen, are you listening to right, what I'm on, saying? listen to what I'm saying? Let's slow this down a bit. Just I this, said let's say it. everything. Listen to me. Because when I told you, Lumos had to back me up and Ross had to back me up. When I said you said Miles, you didn't have said Niles. You made a mistake again. Make ah! a mistake. What the hell is that going Because you're not listening. Because you're not listening. And when you don't listen, you make mistakes. Right. I'm okay. not making mistakes. You're making a mistake because I never said that. What I said to you, right. if you listen to me, is that not everything is doom and gloom. Because if it was, we would not be Oh, no, it's happening. Okay, okay. Right. okay. We're six, six plays. We've got hardly any chance of getting in the Champions League again. We've gone further so down than what we did last year. Rockley, if we 27 Rockley, points okay. behind. We're nearer the bottom so, than the top. Oh, but oh, everything oh, is okay. Listen, Ross, listen, 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 Ross, listen, 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 to mount a serious title challenge again. I want an I want an answer about how long it's going to take in the challenge for the Premier League again. Forget every other team, the Premier League, what's he got to do well, and how long is it going to take? Well, first of all, I would say then that not everything is gloom and doom. How long it could take, it could it could be next season, it could be next season. No, no, how long? Afterwards. So you think... I don't know, I, I, I personally oh, can't tell, but... Come on, bro, I yeah. think, I think when I listen to you, first time I met face to face, Go I on. think you know there's big problems. I think you know it's there's... It's not as bad as let, what, let me, let me finish. what he's making if I, may, if I may. I think you know there's problems. I think there's you I, I think you know what he needs to do. I, you're not a stupid man. You're a very intelligent man. <laughs> the problem you've you. got is I think you feel that if you come out and point out the obvious holes, that you're worried that people will start to feel like your support for Wenger uh, is yielding. What? And remember, you no, can criticise someone and support them simultaneously. Support for type. him will never, ever... It will go on for eternity, yes. Then say Thank you. Then it will say... go on for eternity. My support for the manager will never win. And that's what the what, Forest fans done to Brian saying. Clough and they got relegated in the end. And and so we're in the bottom three now, are we? No, but... I'm oh, okay, saying, so no, so we're not in the bottom gradually three. Gradually, we're going down slowly, but slowly. But yet, short. we're through to the Carabao Cup final, oh, aren't we? Ahmed, so Ahmed here in the comments and says, please calm down, Claude, your blood <laughs> pressure is increasing. Check the trade, Toby, whatever, Carabao Cup. Check a trade, great. check a trade is football. Are you, so are you not prepared to answer that question? No, 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 what I'm, oh, We've got a call coming through now. We'll come back to this, ladies and gentlemen. Hello, welcome to I Fan Park Live. What's your name and who do you support? High blood pressure. <laughs> That's your fault, mate. Hi. Are you right? Je yes, Hello. Hello, Hello, mate. What's your name? Uh, my name is Robin. I'm calling for Susan. 
Hey, hey Sweden. All right. Who do you support? Okay. Who do you support? Yeah, I, I called you guys uh, last time uh, when we played against uh, Chelsea in the uh, semi final. We went through. Oh, so you're a Gooner, yeah? And I, yeah, I'm a Gooner, yeah. All right, cool. Yeah, so uh, I'm. Um, I'm. Uh, I was very. I was. Very, I'm, I, when I'm gonna call, I'm gonna be very nice. I'm not gonna say anything, you know. But the way, the way Ty is going about this, uh, how awesome is is doing in the uh, Arsenal awesome wingers, and just make people just be. His positive positivity gets to negativity. How? Tell me. Tell me how that works. Yeah, so uh, I don't know how, how you can stand behind this manager he's now. A, and, and he's not, a, uh, he's a, let, let the guy talk. Let everybody, the guy talk. everybody, everybody, everybody in the world that can see it, only you and, uh, and uh, everybody the world. Everybody So I'm the, I'm the only Arsenal. So, you, so, all right, then let me get this straight. So, what you're saying to me is, I'm the only Arsenal fan in the world that wants him to stay. Is that what you're saying? And, and you see how you how you act as you no, somebody called him. That no, 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 I'm sorry. Don't let the guy speak. Let me, let me speak, man. I, I see, I seen you talk. I seen you talk for about the, for in in the, um, the half time and now. Yeah. Till, till I get the call. So I see how you added to change towards awesome fans. They're awesome fans like you. Okay. And then when when I they when I they they say they are not win one game, they win out and they yeah. against some some. Of, Stuff that yeah. he do, yeah. And the attitude they see changes and he gets really. I don't have an attitude. I don't have an attitude at all. I'm just saying, you're saying, yeah, you, yeah, no, you, 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 you don't see it, or you don't, no, know I, don't it, I don't have an attitude. You, you tell him, I don't have an attitude. I'm you, sorry, mate. Yeah, I'm sorry, but you said moving to me, on, moving on. No, no, I'm gonna, no, but hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me answer to what you said. You said to me, I'm the only one. So, you're trying to tell me I'm the only Arsenal fan in the world that wants him to stay. Is that what you're trying to say? Is that what you're no, to say? no, no, no. Uh, oh, so you're not I saying that? Maybe you're, you're, you're a handful of Arsenal awesome fans that still uh, back the manager. Okay, so I'm. You do. He's right, okay. though. You do do that. Okay, you're, so, he's right. so, so you're. So, yeah, handful you, of, you, I'm, listen, I'm, 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 I have. Uh, I know what I'm. I, I, I look around. I see people's comments. I see people are the experts. Okay. I, everybody talks about it. Yeah, but you don't know so every, you everybody. Everybody sees it. Yeah, but you don't know every Arsenal fan in the world, do you? It's time to go. <laughs> you don't know every Arsenal fan in the world. It's time to go. You don't know every Arsenal fan in the world. I'm with you, man. You don't know every Arsenal fan in the world. I'm with you. Yeah, you're with him. I agree with you, sir. I agree with you. It's shame there's not many more. It's shame there's not many more. Thank you for your time. Thank you very, very much, guys. Let's go. 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 let us let me speak. Uh, moving on to the game. Are we, are we as Arsenal fans, are we really uh, confident after we've seen Arsenal play against a team from Ostersund? I'm from Sweden, so I know a little bit about them. So, okay. what do you make of them? Like, playing like this, uh, uh, it's, a, it's a great thing they did. They've been, they've been, uh, they've been, the, they started from '96. So, well, they, listen, we play against team that. It's all the, uh, it's the same same time the Arsenal came into Arsenal Wenger came into Arsenal. Now we're playing against them. See how low we have got it, got it? So think about that that how low we've how low we've what that, we've right. sunk. Can I ask him something? Yeah, no, 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 no. Can, no, can I ask you a question, sir? You watch these yes. you watch them in Sweden, yeah? What would you say what, not, what, what level would you say yeah. would you say they are at in in if they were playing in England? What no, I, I think they, they could they could be a bottom club in the championship in in England. They, could, they could actually do that. <laughs> right. Yeah, because they have they went through from the whole the, the, the many division to come up to the top division in Sweden. So right. they do all right. But the, do you see how many how many how many uh, how many they have on the target? They yeah. actually they actually pushed our defense. And yet they lost three 0 Let's see if 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 this yeah. Let's see well, if they this, this, this did was, they lost three 0 uh, Did they lost three 0 So what's the point? Doesn't matter. Doesn't look. No, it doesn't look matter. Like we, so, so the score doesn't matter. The score doesn't matter. You should have be six six zero. Are you trying to tell me the score doesn't matter? Are you trying to tell me the score doesn't matter? It should have been six zero, seven zero against a team like that. We had Ezra and Mkhitaryan on the pitch. We won three 0 So what's the point? Seriously, play like this. Play like this. Play like this. We won three 0 What's the point? He's making a point. Play like this. Play like, can, can I speak here, Ty, please? Play like this against Lazio, against Atletico Madrid, I'm not play uh, like against this, Milan, you? against Dortmund. That, how, how are we, we playing uh, away, away from home this, 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 uh, this season? Yeah, but how many games have we won? 
How many games? Um, I'm not sure. Not, 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 not many. Oh, uh, because you don't want, you don't want to, you don't want to remember stuff like that. Not many. It's <laughs> against your. No, hold, on, hold, on, hold, on, hold 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 on. I don't want to be mad. I don't want to be mad. So now you're telling me. So so I don't. So you're telling me what I think now. So you're telling me what I think now. Is that what you're telling me? You're telling no, me what I think now? Yeah, I, think, I, don't I think he is, you, you, he is. I don't you're, remember. You are, I don't remember. You're telling you, Ty. But you, but you, you, go, you, you are, go, you are, you are the mystic. You are the mystic. You're the mystic man now. You, you can tell me everything, can't you? So you tell me how many easy, games have we easy, lost? Easy, how many games have we lost away easy. from home? Okay, so how many easy. games have we lost away from home? How many games have we lost away from home this season? Easy. How many games have we lost away from home this season? Let him answer, let him answer. How many games have we lost away from home this season? You've got to answer, stop. Go on, mate, go on. You go on. How many games have we lost away from home? Tight, tight, stop talking you, over you him. You go into every game in the league, so you should know how many games we lost. No, I'm asking you. How many games we, I'm asking we you. Do, so. I'm asking you. I'm asking you. How many games have we lost? If you know everything, how many games have we lost? Too many, oh, too many games. Them. Too many games we lost. So you too can't many answer games. them. Too many. So you can't answer. So you're not that clever then. Many. So you no, can't answer we, them. We lost too many. You games. can't answer. So you cannot answer. We, them. Lost, we right. lost too many. You can't mate, we lost too many. Thank you very much for your thank call. You Absolutely much, wonderful. Cool. Wonderful. Yeah, wonderful. Yeah, thank you very much, Cheers, mate. Thank you. Thank you very much, Mister Know It All. There we go. That was fantastic. Fantastic call. Fantastic. Fantastically inaccurate. See. Fantastically inaccurate. Even a man in Sweden is telling you. Yeah, a man right. in Sweden, because he okay. knows more than me, don't he? Ladies and gentlemen, just so you know, you can send us in videos as well. Whether you want to talk about the game tonight, whether you want to pose some questions to Ty or to Claude, the yeah. Dropbox link is down below. You can say what you want and ask what you want. We're open for any types of questions. It's getting very heated in here. The aircon has got to go on. I think a doctor with a defibrillator might be needed as well, because it is getting heated. But please, but please and when you're sending questions, uh, be able to answer them, please. Or if not, there's no point then. Because I didn't, know, I didn't get, I get, you're in Sweden, yeah, but that's all. All right, it's done now, mate. You must finish. You might, 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 you Cool. We're going to go to another one of the questions. We're going to get this put up onto the screen again. Hopefully the app's connected. This is from uh, Raymond. Oh, and no, I've got a phone call. We've got a phone call. We'll do the questions after. Oh, he's gone. Remember, you can call us on 0203 606 0315. I'm going to do this question and then we'll put the, another call through. So it says, this is question for Ty. It says, <laughs> yeah. if Spurs were to win the Champions League this season, would you still back Wenger and want him to stay? Who is that, boy? Who's that from? That is from uh, Raymond14. At Raymond14. And who's his team? He's an Arsenal fan. He's an Arsenal fan asking me that question. Yes. That's a well, very fair question. He wants well, to know, would you still back Wenger well, if Spurs pip you to winning the first Champions League title in North London? Would you still well, back Wenger? Well, that's that's never going to happen. Just like last season. The season before, sorry. Hang on, hang on. I remember, I, I'm going to pull you up here because I watch a lot of you. Go you on. once said anything can happen in football. Yeah, anything if, can if, happen. If, if, if that, if, won't, if, that won't happen. So if Leicester can win the Premier League, Spurs can't win the Champions Absolute, League. Well, That sounds rather hypocritical to me. Well, you can say what you like, but that, I'm, you're right. <laughs> you, said, you said you can win the Padre <laughs> because anything can happen. I never said that. Now said, Spurs no, can't no, win the Champions but League. But Terry, you're misquoting me. I never said that. I you said, said anything no, can happen. If Leicester can win the Premier League, anything can happen. I know it happened. I watched it today. I did my research. Terry, no. You're very wrong. I never said that we say? can win the quadruple. I said, Treble. and this was my absolute, absolute quote, I said, if Leicester can win the league, if we have the luck of Leicester, we can win the quadruple. I never said we can win the quadruple. That is my this exact is, That's exactly it! No, it isn't. That's, if we have the luck, we can win it. No, but that's what not... What if West Spurs have that but luck? Not, but Spurs, have... Spurs are not going to get that luck. Why? They're not going to... Do they're you not... hand the luck out? You have the luck god. They're not, they're not good enough. Because it's Mystic Tie. They're not good enough. But no, no, one... no Myst Mystic from man from Sweden. Come on, come on, answer. <laughs> anyway, so like like I said, no. If that did happen... Ty, which come I don't, on, come which on. Which I don't think... No, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. This is my if question. You no, it's your name, Ty. This is my question. Thank you. It's my question. Thank you very much. Sorry. So... Sorry to interrupt you. Sorry. I don't think it would happen. If it did happen... Would I still back the manager? Of course I would still back the manager. Of course I would still back the manager. Because then that means Tottenham would be the luckiest team. More lucky than us. More lucky than even Chelsea. Oh yeah, I'm sure they're going to worry I don't, about I don't, that. Are, are, are you still interrupting me? Do you think you could... On a, on a real level though, I know we're having a bit of banter here, yeah. right? But would it... How much would it hurt you to see Spurs lift that trophy? Not as much as... Not, not as much as it hurt them. Us winning the league twice. <laughs> no, I, I think though, I think for me, like yeah. them winning that trophy first... That, never you never have that. Because you can't ever trump that. Well, they can never trump the Invincibles. We won the league twice at White Hart Lane, so... No, but how would you feel? How would I feel? T 
Tell me how uh, you feel. Stop the defle- You're very good at deflecting. You should be a politician. <laughs> but I'm going to come back to that question. How, how, how do they feel about us winning the No, no, that's not my question, is it? Well, then, so you got... It, you I want to know how you feel, not them, you. How, well, how is your, is your well, heart going to bleed? Are you going to feel sorry? Are you going to cry? Would bleed, it, it would bleed what? if if what's happened to them happened to us. It wouldn't, no, it wouldn't bleed because it, it's football. And if anything can happen. It wouldn't bleed as long as my team is winning. It doesn't matter what you're not though. Done. Huh? You're not, not though. Mm. But go on, you, you can answer we're that not, question. Not, I'll, tell, I'll tell you something. I know you right? don't back him, but... I'll tell you something. Someone said to me, you've got a choice. Spurs winning the Champions League, but... <laughs> Arsenal yeah. getting relegated, right? Yeah. T- but <laughs> Arsenal getting relegated <laughs> would stop Tottenham winning the Champions League. I'll take it. Wow, that's that's a passionate fan. Hello, welcome to fan. We've got another caller on. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name? All right, mate, it's Paddy again. Hello, Paddy. We, right, know, Paddy. we know you're a gooner. Are you enjoying the show this evening? I'm absolutely loving it. It's like the Jeremy Carl show, mate. <laughs> <laughs> I, hope been, I, hope been, I hope you've been in the football sense and nothing else. I'd just like to say thanks. I'm on Arsenal Fan TV's um, Instagram story, so yeah. Thanks. I think it's Lumos who's controlling that. So yeah, thanks. Oh, right, okay, Lumos. It, it, it is. He's sitting here in the studio yeah. doing his thing, doing his thing. Say, saying, saying things like um, Miles, which Claus said instead of Miles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the third time you brought that up, because mate. Because that's what I mean when you make a you mistake. You mentioned that mistake more than the Invincibles tonight. I'm sure. Well, Paddy... Invincibles, Invincibles. It's amazing you don't. You don't. It's amazing you don't point out Wenger's mistakes this season, isn't it? Yeah, you well, point out the corners. He might make mistakes, but Massive I'm sure mistakes. he will never More mistakes confuse than Mars with. I'm sure he will never confuse Mars with Mars. That's one mistake he didn't Whoa. make. Um, anyway, Paddy. <laughs> exactly. What's your question, Paddy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sorry, Paddy. Sorry, sorry, Paddy. Sorry, yeah, Paddy. Sorry, sorry. He interrupted. But you interrupted, Paddy. Go on, Paddy. Sorry. He. Go on, Paddy. <laughs> um, I'm loving this so much. Um, <laughs> thank you, thank you. I mean, it was it was quite an important victory because now. In the next leg, which is next Thursday, we can now put out a bit more of a relaxed team. That's right. And then we can now focus on the cup final, which is on the Sunday, I think. Yeah. And then we can put, of course, we might as well play Mkhitaryan next week because right. he can't play in the cup final. We can relax at Ozil. Oh, no. Maybe yes. take out Mustafi because, you yes. know, Mustafi can get an injury here and there. Yeah. Like we found out in the international duties. Yeah. So, I mean, the 3-0 victory does give us a cushion... Of course, we need to still put on that bit of um, insurance policy on the bench, just like we didn't do in Nottingham Forest. No yes. insurance, none needed. Just none needed. Me and Ty can play next week. Well, I wouldn't well, say that. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't say that. The only reason why is because I don't think he's in any shape to play. I'm all right, but I don't know about you. So, hey, you said earlier, no personal attacks. <laughs> no, it's not. That's not what, no, calling him for overweight. It's not personal. No, we're gonna need a no, no, I, did, order I said that he's not. He's not in shape to play. So that why I'm, why I'm saying that we shouldn't disrespect. Well, him. I think Claude is one hunk of a man. <laughs> <laughs> and if I was that way inclined, I would definitely be taking this this Grant Mitchell lookalike out. I would, is what I say. Paddy, mate, really appreciate your call. Paddy, thank cheers, you mate. Very much. No, no, no. Take care. I'm not. No, listen. I'm not personally attacking. I'm just saying we still can't afford to underestimate them. In the second leg, we've got to treat like it's new. Yeah, because you imagine if you're given that many chances again in the next game. Yeah, they want to, but with no disrespect to them, I don't think they'll even see the ball at Emirates. I don't think. But also, you say I'm playing, but then those players don't, don't play next Thursday. That I mean, was a joke, by the way. They go into the top, <laughs> into the Man City game, not playing for two weeks. Isn't it? Yeah, that's true. That yeah, yeah, yeah. not good. No, you can, you can lose that bit of inti- yeah, that, that intensity, either, that either. match sharpness. So he's got a bit of, of a dilemma there. I, I, yeah. would, I would play him, actually. Because if you go into yeah, a but... ga- if you've got a lot, of, a lot of them players that are not playing tonight, mm-hmm. right, mm-hmm. go into that game and not play for two weeks. Yes. That's true, but then what about injuries as well? You don't want to get injuries so close to a final, do you? Yeah, it's, it's a tricky one. So it's, 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 it's a tricky one. It's a tricky you one. could have done with a game before that. No, no, yeah, one. I mean, you'd have to do s- yeah. something intense behind closed doors. But um, that's why I actually thought you were better off playing your stronger team tonight, as an example, mm. getting the job done and resting people b- so close to the uh, the, the final. Yeah. Then that would have been my the way of doing it. But well, then true. I'm not Arsene Wenger. But... No, that's true. But then there's, there's the injuries. How yeah, but you can get yeah, but you can get injuries at any really time, fun. can't you? You can. Yeah, but Ramsey the thing is, got when, one in, in, in training, didn't he? He did, but when you when you're playing a team like this, no disrespect. Cool. We have got a video that somebody sent in to us from Andrew. First of all, that we're going to play for you now. So enjoy that, and we'll see you once we return. Hello, Arsenal fan TV. My reaction to the game was good. All right, performance. 
don't know what Bellerin was doing with the penalty. That guy, he's not even good enough for Europa League, so clearly, I think instead of putting Maitland Niles, Maitland Niles at left back, we should put him at right back. Isn't that thing going up? But yeah, it was a good game. We played alright, decent. Um, Tottenham game, yeah, that was a. That's a that was a shit, mate. But I wanted to ask a question to Claude and what's what's that guy? Name? Ty Ty, the guy who has Ty. Yeah, he has the Arsenal water bottle. <laughs> yeah, and um, yeah. Um, my question is. Um, what position do you feel like would be vital? Like I know we need a C um centre back and CDM, but like as Wenger, I don't think Wenger he's gonna go out and spend hundred and fifty million on a centre back and a CDM. So if you were to choose one of the positions, what positions would you choose? Andrew Zorzan. What's your middle name? Samuel. So do people call you Jack? What's your What's your surname? You need to explain the situation. Okay, <laughs> then. So what? So, <laughs> so people always call you by your double barrel middle name. No, because that's not double barrel. His last name is His last name is Maitland Niles. It's double okay, then. So people call you always call you by your no, middle because name. Because middle name is not double barrel. That's yeah, separate. but people don't always call Aisley by Aisley middle name. They just call him Aisley. No, they don't. They call yes, they do. Because yeah. I call him Aisley. Right, right, right. Cool. Anyway, look, we got to go back. We're debating names here. We're <laughs> on Instagram. Obviously, we're back live on YouTube. We did have a question, obviously, from Andrew in that video. Okay. Um, we're going to put it to Ty first of all, and please answer it. He was basically saying. Like defense needs to be improved. What defender would you bring in to improve Arsenal? What's his team? Doesn't matter what his team is. I just want to know. I know what his team is. <laughs> I don't know. You know he didn't say what his team is. It's irrelevant. Why I'm is asking, it irrelevant? Because I'm asking you what centre back you want at your club. Why does who he support matter? <laughs> I was wondering. I can't. He supports. He supports Basingstoke. Go on. What's, answer the question. Basingstoke. <laughs> so why would, have, why would you have a question about us? Because um, he's interested. Do you know if it wasn't... Uh, you you oh are weird. <laughs> Why am I weird? <laughs> because your, your but notion... He's not, but he's not. He's slagging the manager off. Calling the manager a, pack, a bag not, of rubbish. So do you only talk about things that are related to, to you and what... Anyway, yeah, Ty, sorry mate. Claude, what centre-back would you Go bring on, into then. Arsenal? Make sure you don't say Lowe's. Say get, Miles. If we, if we, if yeah, we, exactly. If we, can got, if we get... Do you mind? If we got... Um, if we can get the release calls down, I will go with Toby Alderbrook. Yeah, I'd agree with that. I'd agree yeah, with that. Yeah, that's an interesting one with the release calls. You agree? I'd agree with but that. But it's yeah. a Stoke question. Well, Basin Stoke at, least, at least he didn't say Miles, did he? So. Cool. Um, <laughs> wow. Um, yeah, Toby's thing. I've, I've heard it could be as low as around 20, 25 million, this release clause. And apparently, yeah. Would, and he, apparently, would, he, would he pick Arsenal, though, over other suitors? Do you think he'd come to Arsenal? Well, we hope so. He, 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 was, he might want to stay in London, London, isn't it? But I, I've got a question for on top of that, then. Would he give up Spurs? To come mm. play in the Europa no, League, he wouldn't be giving up. He, he yeah. wouldn't be giving up much. With no disrespect, would it really? I think it's all about money, isn't it? So. Yeah, and but then Arsenal have now broke their their, their 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 cap, haven't you? So, well, hopefully. So what's that there? He wants to join a bigger club. Is it? He wants to join a bigger club. <laughs> well, you're in, you're in trouble then. Now the power shifts happened in London. What power in London? Chelsea. Chelsea. So, Chelsea. so Chelsea, Chelsea doesn't want Chelsea. Wants oh, right. to go to London. He wants to his agent. Who's left? A Millwall. I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking. Look, it'd be, there's no doubt, if Arsenal could bring him in, it'd be an that absolutely be tremendous signing. Uh, for me, the best centre back in the league went, went fit, I think. Yeah, 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 one of the best. Yeah, Got to like look out for his number. gambling problem, though. He's had a bit of time out from football with gambling. Well, allegedly. 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 Yes. Allegedly. Allegedly. Yes. Allegedly. Allegedly. Everything's allegedly. Allegedly. Oh, allegedly. We're getting shown pictures here of Sol Campbell laughing. Can you imagine the carnage? I mean, it wouldn't be as bad as Sol Campbell because it was a free, he was homegrown. It wouldn't homegrown. be, and that was, and that, by the way, that was absolutely disgraceful, the way Sol was treated. Absolutely disgraceful. What? Hang on a minute, hang on, hang on. Oh, hang on, I was, I, I was at Old Trafford when Van Persie played against you lot, yeah. and you lot were singing all sorts of nastiness and about him. Wrong it was your well. song, it was your song. That was all... <laughs> oh, no, it was our song. I, I'm not saying it was right. It was, it was when we did it. Oh, right. I'm just asking you. That was wrong, but that was wrong. I was, that was wrong. I don't she agree. said, no, no, I'm not singing yeah, it now. Yeah, no, no, that's, <laughs> no, that is absolutely ridiculous. And our fans you don't, are singing You don't ever abuse, condemn, you, you abuse no football as ever. No, 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 what's, what's the point in abusing I it? heard once that you abused the mascot at West Ham. 
Okay, well, <laughs> once again, you've you've got the wrong end of the stick. Is that come from no, DT? I, no, no, DT told me that you were trying uh, to have a fight with the, the yeah, hammer mascot D, from West Ham. DT, all, you all, said that DT you also wanted... said I'm deranged, which is not true. Did you not say that you wouldn't do that down at Millwall, didn't you? Yeah, I did say that, but that's not abuse. Abuse is swearing, insulting, no. cursing, abusing. I said Telling to him, someone they're overweight. That's, um... No, 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 no. <laughs> you've I didn't tell him abusive to me tonight. How am I being abusive to you? It's not my fault that you We've said no call. instead of my We've got a call. We've got a call. We've got a call. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name? And, and Ty wants to know who you support. <laughs> yeah, good evening. Um, my name's Ali. I support Chelsea, yes. You are, Ali? Oh, right, okay. Anyway, Ali, what would you like to say, right, mate? So my Basically, what I want to say is, um, how does it feel right now to be an Arsenal fan? Um, especially what happened with um, Tottenham and Juventus. We see well, Tottenham literally... Right, we'll, go, we'll go with Claude first, okay. and we'll come to like, Claude. <laughs> so, and, and, these are the questions I love. So, I love how, how do you feel to be an Arsenal fan right now for you, Claude? I feel hurt watching Tottenham the other night. They were um, the way they come back. They showed the... Because if that was us 2 nil, Dad... We would have completely faded out the game, and they came back. They showed character. They showed everything, all the top qualities that you need to be challenging for that trophy. That's, that's, you talking about top right. and, and, Go, go and, on, Ali. And, 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 I'm, I'm a Chelsea fan. Obviously, we're not doing too well, so I'm not biased at all. But especially what Tottenham done. If it was Arsenal, that wouldn't have happened. Especially Arsenal playing on Thursdays nowadays. Um, I think Wenger needs to go. You guys need to have um, maybe a Simeone needs to come in and literally like boss the team. I think you guys need a centre back. Xhaka needs to go. Xhaka is probably the biggest waste of money there's ever. Probably the worst centre of the season. Um, so I think without Wenger, I don't think there's going to be any changes. To be honest, I think Wenger needs to go. You guys need to bring in a centre back and a defensive midfielder. And I, I'm ha I'd have hundred percent to say there's been a power shift. Tottenham are one hundred percent the I bigger agree. team in North. <laughs> <laughs> You sure you're not sure you're not playing PlayStation. I agree. What what the only thing is that what need Tottenham need to do though is to put a trophy on that. So then that yeah, means there's not a power shift. I do that's agree, true. and it hurts me. It really I does hurt agree. me to see the way that, I don't agree. The, the way they're playing I, the foot their football. I'm sorry, I don't agree. I don't agree. It at hurts all. me to see that, that we I don't, I don't we, agree we actually all. had that striker in, it, we actually had that striker on our books. It hurts me. What when he was nine years old? It hurts me big time, so, mate. Ali, Ali go on. what do you want to say, mate? Go on. So, I'm not... Listen, I was watching the game against Juventus. They were 2-0 down. What we saw what we saw Tottenham do, I couldn't believe. I was in shock. To see them just boss Juventus like that, holding mm -hmm. possession. you got Dembele, probably one of the best in the mids in the whole league. As I say, Arsenal need a Dembele sort of player. Xhaka's not doing it for me. Wilshere is obviously a good player, but you guys need that solid Kante sort of player that's going to be dirty in the middle. And without that sort of change, I don't know how it's going to work. You've got a lot of good attacking players, but there's no balance in the team. Spurs got a good balance in their squad. Oh. And I'd happily say there's been a massive power shift. Yeah, but... And... Oh, go on. But Ali, yeah, but, Ali, but, but Ali, then you're saying the power shift. So what have Tottenham won then? Okay, listen. I no, 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 hold on, hold on. Hold on. You said there's a power shift. What have Tottenham won? There has, there has been a so, power shift. No, but hold on, hold on. If there's a power shift, that means... That, oh, oh, Ali, if I, if I listen to what you said, if there's been a power shift, what have Tottenham won? Is my question to you. That's my first question. No, what is the question? What, 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 you've answered it. Go on, go on, Ali. All right, cool. You're talking about trophies. What have you won in the last seven, eight years? Just a few FA Cups. Not, it's not a, a few big FA deal. Cups. We've won the most FA Cups, Ali, ever. It's not a few right, FA cool, Cups, my friend. What I'm trying to it's not a few FA Cups. All right, cool. What I'm trying to okay. say is you take my word, Bracky. Last season, they finished the top of you. I can't see Yeah, you they won nothing. I can't see you guys finishing on top of Of course the you could, but Ali, you're going to, as a Chelsea fan, what are you going to say then? But what are you going to say then? Let, let, me, let me ask Ali, Ali, can yeah, I, can yeah, I ask you a I question? Would say, I would say they need to win a trophy. Yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll touch Which on that in a minute. So, I, I want to ask Ali one final question before he goes. Right now, right. you know, you've mentioned you guys ain't doing very well. There's a lot of issues. Would you swap your manager, Conte, with the problems he has for Wenger? Oh my God, no chance, no chance. No, we wouldn't no swap. Chance. We wouldn't swap Conte with with either. This is the difference. This is the difference. What's the difference? What's Conte? Yeah, let me tell you. No, Conte's a quality manager, but yeah, if he doesn't he do shows well, it. Abramovich is going to kick him out. When the board is not lined up. Wenger runs the whole the whole of Arsenal's run by oh, Absolutely. Oh, 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 oh. Ali, Ali, so we, so we one sec. Ali, mate, absolutely amazing, amazing call. Cheers, um, have you on again t another time? Cheers, Brilliant. Ali. Yeah, thank uh, Cheers, mate. Thank you, guys, man. Take care. Cheers. Yeah, thanks, let's, let's go thanks, back to thanks, his original thanks, question. Thanks, Ali, but I, 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 you're wrong. You didn't you didn't answer the question. Tottenham have not won anything. Yeah, so okay, he's gone ship. now. It's he's gone. Fight. He's gone. Yeah. yeah. Anyway, so was, so, 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 so was Miles. What, what, oh, sorry, what no. was his original question? Do you remember his original his question? His original question was, how do you feel? 
Yeah, so how do you feel as a fan right now? <laughs> I don't feel nonplussed. Why, why is it, what I don't understand is, why is a Chelsea fan ringing up to ask an Arsenal fan? Because he loves feel? football. Yeah, but if you love football, why don't you ring up and say, how would you think Chelsea fans feel? Why are you asking me? Because you're an Arsenal fan and he wants exactly. to ask you. But he's a Chelsea Look, fan. So I'm why gonna, is he ringing up asking I'm me gonna that? Take, I'm going to take the rose clint tinted glasses yeah. off, yeah? Well, I'll put the green and it hurts on. me, it hurts me. But they're playing... They've played some great And they've won against nothing. Us. And they've they won great nothing. So, yeah. so, uh, and they look, they look they miles play? ahead of okay, us. Then, so, like, uh, they look miles ahead. Did they play great football when we beat them 2-0 no Emirates? Did they play great football then? Well, no. Because okay, no. Okay, then. So there was not no power shift then. That was then. Yeah, what do you now mean that I'm was then? About but now. hold on, hold on. This is the business end no, of the no, season. No, hold on, hold on. This is when it matters. Don't say that was then. Don't say that was then. But this is the business end of the season. You can't say that was then because Match City have not started winning now. They started winning when they were breaking records. Isn't it? That's why they're the right, let me, You can't say that, was it? Let me just slow down a second. So the power shift, this brought us on to the power shift conversation, power obviously. Shift. No, no, let me, let, let me finish. Yeah. So obviously I had a big debate on, on Saturday after the North London derby about the power shift. And yeah. I, I listened to it back yeah. and the guy was right and, and so was I, but the problem you have with the power shift is nobody clearly, and my point where we're both right is, the definition of the power shift is what needs debating over whether it's not happened because my definition of power shift is who the better team is right now. I don't, it's not about who's won the most trophies, whose history's well decorated. Some people believe the power shift is when you're winning more, when you've got the biggest records, and when you can attract the better players. So, okay, it, so from your point of view, what right. would you, what in your mind, what is a power shift? I'll tell you what a power shift is. When Tottenham ended up higher than us last season, and we won the FA Cup for the record time, I saw Tottenham fans, and they was trying to say to me, "Oh, what happened to you?" I said, "Hold on, you've ended up higher than us when." It's like this, Terry. I'll break it down to you, like I broke it down to the Tottenham fans. Yeah, I said. 22 years we end up higher than Tottenham. That means that I, or you, or Cloud, or Terry, or, or Jack, sorry, or Lumos, you're Terry, sorry, or Ross, yeah. could have had a baby and risen. Your lovely son, Archibald, could be 22. 22 years we end up higher than them. That means you could have raised Archibald. Archibald's okay, a little so boy now. Let me, let me ask you this question. Talking about that, we're talking about now. So, no, no, hold on, hold on, hold on. So, hold on. so, well, so what I'm saying is. Is it going to take them that long to be big and be, be, uh, uh, power shift it? Well, that's what, if they can end up 22 years. No, no. Sorry, that's not yeah, yeah, sorry, sorry. sorry. No, no, let me finish. Let me finish, please. Let me finish. Sorry about that. <laughs> Prop it in my eye. I see the water drop. <laughs> sorry. So, what I'm saying is. We've done it for 22 years in a row. That's a whole adult life from 0 to okay, 18 okay, to okay. 21. Let me, let me slow you down a second. So uh, let me try and paraphrase. So you're yeah. saying a power shift is when a team catches up on all your accomplishments. Absolutely. And then so, no, so, by your, so by your definition of power shift, overtakes Man City them. are not. Uh, Man City don't have the power of Man United right now. No. Listen, I wish they did. But they don't. Man. No, they don't because so, what match like the third? So we're still the biggest team in England. No, 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 not not. I, I wouldn't say. So that. we. So but we've. we've I wouldn't we've, say the. We've I now beat. Oh, 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 oh. I wouldn't say the biggest team. Listen, but you said we were. I'm. I'm kind of putting you in a corner here because <laughs> you said that Liverpool are the biggest team still, but Man yes. United have beaten their record. So based on your yeah, definition, Man United have won, oh, have won oh, five oh, Champions oh, Leagues, have they? But we've won more. We've won more trophies. But Man United have won five Champions Leagues. Listen, but we've won more. Um major trophies than they not have. Not in all, not in all. Yes, we have. You won five Champions Leagues. No, we won more trophies. You add up all the Premier Leagues and all the, and all the big European Cups and FA Cups are the big trophies, yeah? So We've won more. How many of you lot won? Because, I don't actually know the exact number. We're three or four ahead of them. Apparently, Liverpool, from what I understand, Liverpool have won the most. No. But I'm not sure. I'm not then, sure. Then if be, you take out I'll Charity I'll, Shields... I can't be quoted on that. We're, we're at the top. But, but I'm, I'm trying to add the same. So your, but anyway, your version of a power shift yeah. is... When you've won more, done all this, and you've and you've then done more. Well, then it's going to take thirty or forty odd years. And, so like, what, what, and, and I agree with you more. For me, it's more about the here and now. So no, no, because, okay. Because you know the reason why, Terry. Sorry to interrupt. The reason why I say it's not here and now because the thing is, when I saw the Tottenham fans, I said, well, "What happened to last season?" Oh, don't talk about last season. But yeah, if they'd won last season, oh yeah, we had, that's what I mean. They some Tottenham fans always want to move the goalposts. Because they okay. apparently challenged Leicester for the league, but they didn't win it. But oh yeah, we're not higher than you. We we won't have to go. Oh, it doesn't matter, but we end up higher than you. Okay, no, so, I, I understand. You know I, mean? I, I know. I get you on that point. I agree you know with I mean? you on that point. There, yeah. the, the mean you disagree on what power shift means. Yeah. So that's why there's no point us debating it because <laughs> no, because our definition is different. And, and yeah, that's, yeah, and that's, that's, that's fine. Some, that's fine. Sometimes a lot of you can't go on FA Cups because if you go you can. on winning FA Cups, you can say that we're going to got a power shift over Tottenham because they won it a few years ago. Well, I was, have they won more than Tottenham? No, but I, yeah, in terms that's what I'm trying to say. I understand that. Yeah. No, but no, we're but not just talking about We're not talking about FA Cups. We're not talking about FA Cups. We're talking about winning the league so at Old Trafford. That. We're talking about the Invincible. That was before. And now it's not happening now, is it? Yeah, but it's not happening now. 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 Yeah, but it's not happening now.
That's gone. It's history. You didn't see. We're now in this time. Did it's you see 2018. The from, did you see the comment from the man that you should calm down for your blood pressure? You didn't see that comment. Well, you're making me because you talk no, no, absolute you're crap all no, the time. But, no, but the thing is, but I'm not you the one talk. who said Miles. Let's get this straight. So What's that going to do with it? One day, so you said I'm talking crap. Did I say miles? miles? Did I say miles? One day. So you say kilometers. That. Don't say that then. Kilometers, miles, If you're saying I'm talking crap, you're the one who said miles, my friend. Ladies and gentlemen, you're welcome to Fan Park Live. You're the one who said miles. Is that crazy? You're bringing up miles. Because now you're laughing. You're about bloody you see, miles. Because now you're laughing. So kilometers that, that's or one, bloody all whatever. I, all I have to do is, uh, uh, is say miles to you and that will make you calm down. But like what I was saying that you're saying that, I'm sorry, you cannot count things on one one season that's absolutely ridiculous you count on the seasons gone past and Tottenham are no not... you don't you can't what's happening now okay, okay. let's just let's, let's, okay, let's, okay. Let's, 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 let me just we've got a call and then we're going to come back to this I don't believe this I, I, don't I believe love this. this game I don't believe this hello I welcome to Fan Park Live what's your name buddy hello my name is Rocky Rocky hello, hello Rocky <laughs> what's happening what, who do you support I support Arsenal Right, Rocky. Uh, what do you want to say, mate? What do you want to say? I would like to say, um, Ty, I, yeah. I disagree with you a lot because I think you're a very delusional person. Pardon? I think you're delusional. So you know me then, do you? <laughs> no, he's basing it on what you say. You know me, so, what... so, you, so you know me then to call me delusional. You know me, do you? I don't know you. Okay, then, so you can't. So if you don't know me, how can you call me delusional then? That is your perception. Your perception of what you think. I'm no, don't be rude. Don't be rude, mate, because you called me. So don't be rude. Don't be rude, because you called me. Don't be rude, my friend. There's no, 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 no. There's no, there's, there's no type of rudeness on this show. You know, listen, you called me. So don't be rude. Don't be, no, but don't be rude. Don't be rude, because you called me. No, don't be, listen, don't be rude, because you called me. You call me, so don't be rude, okay? Don't be rude. No, listen, don't be rude, because you call me. Don't, don't tell me to say that. You call me. Let, let the caller talk. He's spending money calling. Don't be rude, then. So don't be rude, then. Go on. Don't be rude. Ty, let me speak. You're very aggravating person. Yeah, because you know me, don't you? Stop talking. He's a child. Let him speak. Yeah, he shows it. He should be doing his homework. I'm very aggro you're very aggravating person. Yeah, because you know me, don't you? Stop talking over Vendor. him, let me speak. Stick up, don't be rude, man. For Arsene Wenger oh, yeah, oh, oh, when, he does the the wrong, when he does the wrong things. We're six go straight, watch ch children we're channel. sixth place in the league and our defence is a shambles. We played, we, okay, we must have, we may have won today 3-0, but oh, that don't matter, the chances it? that we let them create and how we lost against Tottenham were not good enough. Wenger doesn't have the mindset to help us progress in the league. And the fact that you stick up before him... I swear to you, Arsene Wenger, and I don't care if it's annoying, it's what I think, Rocky. okay? It's what I think. Well said, Rocky. It's what I think, Rocky, Rocky okay? Rocky, 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 Rocky. It's a shame, Rocky, it's a shame you're not old enough to live up to your name, isn't it? You should take a bottle of Claude's book, Ty, because you're very delusional and I don't... Yeah, because you know me, don't you? You know me, don't you? I don't have to know you to... You don't know me, then, so if you don't know me, don't tell me what I'm like. If you don't know me, don't tell me what I'm like. If you know you don't know me, goodbye, goodbye, and do your homework. My homework's done, bro. <laughs> Mate, What's that? Sorry? Rocky, great call. Thank what you, my friend. Thank you. Listen, listen. What did he say? He, he said his homework's done, thank you. Oh, that's good then. <laughs> well, listen, if it's good, then no, no, no. Tight, tight, tight. On the level, no, no, right? On the, on the level, Tom, can I say something? Listen, Terry, I'm, my I'm, name sorry, is Sorry, sorry, Terry. No, no, can, can I just Tom. say something? No, can I just no, say something? No, 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 no. Turn. Let me just, no, no, I don't care. Let me say something. Gonna gonna no, let me say something on the real. Listen. I appreciate, we appreciate you ringing up, but don't be ring up and be rude, please. Because I'm not being rude to anybody out there. No, so don't being ring. He is being rude. When you're telling me to shush, you're being rude. Because I'm not telling you to shush. You're ringing us, aren't you? So if you're ringing us, can you not be rude, please? Because I'm not being rude listen, to anybody. Listen, tight, listen, listen, listen. If you're a kid, tight, we've got to move on. Learn move some on. respect. We've got to move on. We've got to move on. We've got to move on. We've got, another, we've got another video to play for you now. Um, that's been sent in to us via Dropbox. Um, I have to say, this is the greatest fan park live I have ever done. These two are amazing. And it's not scripted. Enjoy the video. We'll be back very <laughs> shortly for you. Good evening, gentlemen. Candid news, yours truly. Please follow me on Facebook. I won't shout out to Ty. Ty, you must admit, it's time for Wenger to leave our club. Wenger out, Ancelotti in. And the only reason why we won this match was because they were so poor defensively. But there were so many opportunities for Ostersons actually to tear our midfield into pieces. Thanks very much, guys. Be safe. I'm out. Hi, as a fan TV, Ty and Claude, thank you for being passionate fans of our beloved club. 
Uh, my question for both Ty and Claude is um, even if the manager decides to stay, knock on wood that he leaves, but well, let's say if he stays, um, tactically, what type of changes would you want to see happen um, in the team? One of, I think, the biggest concerns, I believe, in how the team sets up is that our wingbacks push forward too far. And instead, they should be tucking in to provide additional support to Grant Xhaka or whoever the deep line midfielder is. The second thing is that I don't think that um, the foot in football, we have that defensive midfielder anymore. I think we have deep line playmakers who can read the game, control the game, but can initiate the, the offense. Uh, so I think that's where sometimes you get a little bit misguided. What do you think? Hello, everybody. I hope you enjoyed those videos. Ty has now just calmed down. But look. I haven't calmed down. No, I haven't calmed down. <laughs> I ain't calm down. He hasn't calmed down. I ain't calm down. Listen, so we can do some player down. ratings. We can do some player ratings now. Down. Okay, we'll, we'll do some player ratings. So I'll start with Claude, your goalkeeper tonight, Espina. Mm. What would you rate him out of 10? Little, save, save the penalty. Yeah, yeah save the penalty. Give him six. Six out of 10. Didn't six out of 10. Else, Let's go Bellerin for you. Oh, should I say the news in the comments? Because Rocky knows, doesn't he? Um, Hector, seven. Hector, seven. <laughs> Chambers. Yeah, they did. They did comfortable, weren't they? I'll give him seven. Yeah. Seven. Yeah, you got Mustafi next to him. Uh, Rocky, where are you? You got answer? Um, <laughs> seven. Yeah, it's true. So you, you give uh, seven. Okay. Uh, your left back tonight was uh, who was the left back tonight? Uh, Monreal. Uh, yeah, mate. You scored a goal. What, what would you give him? Yeah. Yeah, scored again. Um, no, hasn't let us down this season, really. I mean, he had a bad game on Saturday, but. Bounce back tonight. I'll give him a seven tonight. Seven. Mr. Maitland Niles in the middle. Not Maitland Miles. <laughs> okay. Ainsley, Rocky, where are you? Uh, Rocky, you can answer. Uh, Ainsley, I'll give him a seven as well. Because Rocky knows everything, don't he? Cool. You had, obviously, you had Rocky a, knows a, me, don't he? I'm a gonna, wo I'm, a I'm hear about uh, El Nenny, sorry, first. All the way home tonight. Oh, yeah. About Rocky. Um, Rocky Balboa. Rocky, okay. what, is, what, what are we on? Uh, El Nenny. Reasonable job, six out of ten. Nothing matched. I'll let you do Ozil. Mesut, nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. It's not. No. Yeah, well, uh, who's the other guy who was up there? Um, Awobi. Was that where we started? Alex. Yeah. yeah. Alex yeah, Awobi. Another good. He had an alright game. I think he's been playing well lately as well. I was surprised he was on the bench on. Yep. On um, Saturday, I'm going to give him seven tonight. Seven for him. Super Danny Welbeck. <laughs> Why is that super Danny Welbeck? That's what we called him at Old Trafford. I love Danny Welbeck. I'm being respectful. <laughs> Seriously. Danny didn't do much. Well, you uh, go. Should have I, had I, chances. I, I, he didn't let him go personally. Um, I'll give him... I'll give Danny seven. Seven out of ten. Oh, Mkhitaryan played, didn't he? Yeah. He said a who? Yeah, Mkhitaryan. Yeah. He played in the middle of the three. No, I know, but I, have I only done ten players? Yeah, game. yeah seven, Mkhitaryan, seven, sorry. Seven. seven. He done all right. And then the big question. What would you rate Wenger this evening? You can go first. The manager... Seven. Seven. Eight, eight, eight out of ten. Because eight. The, the, the job was done, so... And would That's you cool. agree with that eight out of ten? Oh, it's a bit strong, eight. Of course it's strong. I'll give him, I'll give him six. Try ten. I mean, we're on the opposition. It's, a bit, a bit, it's hard to mark him on this one because... It's a no win one for him. I wouldn't like to mark him down or up on this one. Well, that's interesting. So give him like a solid six. six. Yeah, that's good. Got a few questions from the Instagram um, people this evening. This is from J dot underscore fortune, spelt very snazzily with O's and upper and lower case. I love when people do that. It says Claude and Tyre, who do you think Arsenal should sell? Ooh. <laughs> Go to call first on this one. Who would you sell? Which which one player out of everyone do you want Wenger to say on your bike to? Well, will he be here in the summer? Let's uh, just, just say Wenger's here. Who, who would you um, sell? Who would I sell if it was down to me? Um, ooh, ooh. You know what I'm going to say? Uh, Granite Xhaka. I think he's. I think he's done nothing for me this year. I think we can get mm. some money back for him. Cool. That's a tough question. So, there any of the players you're not happy with, Ty, or you don't mm. think are good enough for your club? Uh, I don't know. I don't. Okay, the, the question is, can we afford to sell anyone without bringing in reinforcements? I don't know. I don't know. I, I don't know that. I, 
I can't answer because I'd, I'd have I'd have to look at the squad. I think the players we should have sold, like people like Matthew Matthew Dubusi, he's gone. Theo's gone, unfortunately. Even yeah, but they're already gone. Theo's Theo's who's there? You sell. So the, no, what I'm saying is, is that you're asking me. So I'm saying to you, I'm trying to look at the squad at the moment. I don't see anyone we can or should sell if we're not going to make ourselves weaker. Because at least you're going to bring people in, of course. But is it, if you could get rid of one player and then say that Toby Elba, Toby's coming in from Spurs, yeah. which centre back would you sell to make space for him? I'll narrow it right down. I don't know. That's a that's a difficult one because I wouldn't get rid. I wouldn't get rid of anyone at the moment. I wouldn't get rid of Callum. Callum and Rob are not playing at the moment. We would have to get rid of a centre. I would get Kishildi out. I, think I wouldn't get rid of Lauren. I wouldn't I get would rid of Lauren. Get, so that's a that, that, that's a that's a that's a that's a difficult one. Possibly I could, I someone just, I wouldn't want to sell it would be my maybe Mohammed but I I would even I really wouldn't want to sell it. Cool. Another question that's been sent in here by Scott underscore T J. 05, who says, with Lacazette out and Danny Welbeck not at his best, mm. do you think it's, it's time to start considering some more youngsters? Yeah. So you've got that young lad. Is it Eddie? What's Eddie he? Nekatea. Yeah, Eki Nekatea up front. Would you? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Would you prefer him? Eddie Nekatea, yeah, I would like him to see him get a chance, but is he, is he quite ready for this for the bigger games, I wonder? I'm not so sure. Um... Would you rather? Would you rate him over? Would you would rather him? To, look, you see, look, the Europa League. You saw Man United play. Uh, they were forced to. They brought in Rashford, the yeah, youngster who rose to the occasion, it, yeah. and it was the making of right. him. And he's still got a long way to go. He's still he's not not finished article yet. But you know, you look at Danny Welbeck, and that the was most, the Europa League. It was game, Europa it? against uh, the um, Mitch, Mitchelland or Michelin, yeah, something Germany, like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He came in, and then a few days later, he knocked a couple of goals past us. Didn't yeah, he? I wasn't even going to mention that. Yeah. I weren't going to do that, but, it, but it's. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, with but you look like Danny Welbeck isn't a goal scorer, really. He doesn't score many goals. He he's injured a lot. Is it right? That's is the worry it, for me. It is. Yeah, if he goes, is it not right? Just give one of your youngsters. Your academy's there to produce players. Give them a chance. And do you know what? If he flies, you know it could be the making of him. Yeah, well, but I don't know. I yeah, that, I can understand that. But I don't know if that's going to be. It's it's only going to be in. Well, I don't know. Where, where where can it be? Where can it be? Because can we afford? Yeah. Possibly the second leg against this team, possibly. But starting up front in the Premier League game, no. I don't think they're ready yet. Cool. So I'm just uh, going through comments here on, on, on a number of channels. I'm just looking at Cords, Arsenal Fan TV, my channel, The Football Terrace. Everybody's quite unanimous that Rocky is now a cult legend outside yeah, of the movie. Balboa is. Balboa is. Yeah, this guy, Bal a lot of people are saying this guy knocks you out like Balboa. Of course he does. Of course With he, his words, that's of course what people are saying. Of course, he, of course he does. He, he really locked me out because I, I'm dazed, aren't I? My gosh, Rocky, what, Ty, where are you? Ty, he's rattled you. He's rat no, the thing is, no, yes. he hasn't rattled me. I don't yeah, mind. I don't, I, don't mi yeah. I don't mind people saying, but don't be rude. That's where I take exception no, about rudeness. Year old has got you so, guys, about about guys we'll where, where, where I take exception, sorry, Terry, is Go rudeness. On. You don't have to be rude. You can say what you like, but don't be rude because you don't have to tell me to shush. We have That's more Dropbox rat videos. Ra rattled by who? Rocky. Rocky's a biscuit that can be broken. <laughs> This, oh wow. Dad, I hope you're proud of what I'm doing with my life. <laughs> um, we've got more drop boxes for you right now, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy and we'll be back in a little moment. Hi, you guys watching on Fan Park Live. Subscribe to Claude and subscribe to the Football Terrace and subscribe to Arsenal Fan TV. So, my review of the game was I thought we played well, I thought we played as well as we needed to play, if not a little bit better. Than I thought we were going to play. I thought that our young players impressed me today. Maitland and I especially performed on a reasonably small stage but still performed today and that's why I would maybe give him my man of the match. Now the thing is I just want to pause Claude and Ty a question which is do you think the blue kit, the blue away kit for Arsenal do you think it's done us badly this season? And do you think it's let us down? Because we've done well in the black and pink kit and we've done well in our home kit. But the away kit, the blue kit, has let us down. So why is that? Claude and Ty, that's my question to you. Thanks, guys, for watching this little video from me, Mr Junior Gunner. Of course, I have a YouTube channel, Mr Junior Gunner. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Question for you. Why can you not just let him go? Yes, we've won a couple of FA Cups,
but we really haven't done anything since 2006 where we made the Champions League final, and we haven't won the league since 2004. Why is it so hard for you to accept that the game's changed? You're starting to sound like a U.S. International, U.S. national team fan. Like I always tell people, that is not a good thing, because they are the most deluded set of fans. So please, why can't you just let him go? And Claude, best part of Arsenal TV. Thanks for taking this question, man. Thank you very much for that video being sent. And remember, you can send the, send them into us via the Dropbox. Just to paraphrase what the guy was going through there, he was asking Ty, just why can't we let Wenger go? And also, he said, Claude, you are the best thing from Arsenal Fan TV. Thank you very much, man. That's uh, brilliant. That's yeah. fantastic to know. That. Next. Thank you very much. Next. <laughs> Next. That, you know. Next. He doesn't like it, does he? Rocky, come on. Oh, no. Sorry, go away. You don't want Rocky on again to knock you out, do you? <laughs> he didn't knock me out. I think Rocky well, won that debate. Of course he, he did. did. Of course he did. He, he caught you with that left in, left in the know, chin. Well, the out. thing is, look at my chin. There's not even any dirt on it. No. Verbally. We've got a phone call coming through. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. What's your name and who do you support? Hello, I'm, I'm Louis. I'm, um, I'm Arsenal fan. You Hello, Louis? mate. Hello, what do you want to say this evening? Yeah, just saying, um, I think Ty's a bit deleted. <laughs> yeah, do you know me? Um, do you know me? I'm sorry, but do you know me? Do you know me? No, I'm Ty. sorry, no, but do you know Hang me? Hang on, Ty, let the man... St can you? Can, I'm going to jump in this just to control it. Can you explain to us, and I'll give you the right to... Exactly you can take your one, and then you can come back, Ty. Why do you feel Ty's deluded? What is it that he says <laughs> that makes you feel that he is? I think being a when you're in fan. Um, no, I'm an Arsenal I fan, think... mate. There's a difference. Well, no, you do. There's a difference between Arsenal and Wenger. Let, let you want Wenger to stay. You shush, Jack. Um, I'm more with Claude, and I hate Wenger. And you I hate Wenger, but yet you support out. the club. You're saying, so let me just get to you. You hate the manager, but you support the club. Does that make any sense to you? Yeah, yeah it does. How, does it, no, how do you hate the manager and support the club? Tell me. Well, I've been an Arsenal fan for 17 years. No, how years. Do, do, right, but how do you hate the manager and, and support the club? Tell me. How does that work then? So when the manager comes out, I you boom, do you? So when the manager the comes on the touchline, do you manager. boom? When the manager comes on the touchline, do you boom? I never like the manager. Sorry, no, but you said you hate him, but you support Arsenal. So when the manager comes out, do you boom then? Because that's what you do to someone you yeah. hate, isn't it? I do boom. You do boo? I boo earlier when and you think that And you think that is okay for a fan to boo the club manager? You think that's okay? Yeah. Okay then. Well, goodbye. Thanks for the phone call. <laughs> you are still live on the air because I control the phones here. Um, anything else Sorry, you would like to say about this evening? Um, I'm Evan Claude. Um, that is passion, and I believe him and uh, DT are correct about when going. You should go. There we go. Say that again. Mate, thank saying? you very much for your what call. Did he say? Great Basically call, saying, look, no, he, he says about the whole Wenger in, Wenger out situation, he believes that the approach that DT and Claude have is right and, and that yours is delusional. No, no, the thing about that is that, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't know where this debate is going. Because where do we go from I'm deluded to you hate the manager? Hate. Hate is a very strong word. We're talking about football, aren't we? We're not talking about any other yeah, subject, like, I think, look, I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to answer that question. So this is, when people say this hate... Is, in the football context, I don't think they hate it like they want to kill him. Terry, they hate him being at the football Terry, club. Is what that's they mean. fine, but then with anything, we've got to clarify what we mean and what we're talking about because words are very, very, very strong. So if you're saying that now, you're saying you hate him. That's a very strong word from you're saying you don't like him. You think he should leave. So there's because a guy on Instagram, put he's, asked, he's asking, would you rather have Wenger or Guardiola? If you have a chance to swap, yeah, you, to, you might need to reiterate that. Yeah, so we had a, a question come through from Insta that Ross just shared with us, and you guys can answer this in the live comments wherever you are. Um, we'll do the call and we'll come back to this question. It's a big question. Hello, welcome to Fan Park Live. Uh, what's your name my and name, who do you support? Uh, my name is Joe. And who do you support, You're Joe? Right? Uh, I support Cholton Athletic, and I've got a mate called Bill next to me who supports Arsenal. Oh, okay. Top boys! Top boys! What, what do you want to say this evening? Up the attic! Uh, we just want to say, um, I think it might be time for Wenger to leave. I think if you look at our recent... Uh, you're not going, you're not so, sorry, sorry, sorry. can you start that again? Ty sorry, was sorry, talking. Sorry, no, Claude was. Alright, um, we think that it might be time for Wenger to go. We think um, the recent away record for Arsenal this season, you know, there's only won three games. From a League One perspective, I think it might be time for him to go. Charlton Athletic fan. So is that in, Le in League One thinks Wenger should go? What's your response? No, is that a question or is that a comment? It's a comment. Uh, it's, it's a comment, yeah. Okay, then I don't agree. That's all. I don't agree. That's all. That's all. I don't agree. That's all I'll say to him. And why is that? Why huh? is that? Why is that? 
Why don't why 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 don't I agree? Yeah. Why should I tell me why I should agree? No, he's asked uh, you a question. Well, no, but that's the thing. Was it a comment or a question? No, but then he said but it, it's a comment. You said you don't agree, and then he asked you a question as to why don't you agree. So it's your turn to answer it. But why? What if I back the manager? Why would I agree with that? But tell him um, why you back the manager. He knows yeah, why, what? but he knows why. He, he doesn't. Knows he's why. asking. He said, "You don't know why I back the manager." Yeah. Why do you yeah. back him? Oh no! So he's, somebody just said yes. They know. No, he says yes. Why do you back him? So he's on, So tell him why you back him. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Can you say that again? So are you asking me why I don't think the manager should go, or you know no. I back the manager, or what? Sorry, go on. Yeah. So what we're trying to say is, yeah. Why do you back the manager even after like how like Spurs have had a power shift kind of? And, they were okay. Go on. Uh, go on. Well, first of all, they were. Like, yeah. Go on. Sorry. Go on. And how um, the recent away record this season is just not been up to scratch, you know. Okay then. So last season, what happened? We're not talking about last season. No, 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 no. Hold on, no. You said one of you said there's a power shift, yeah? Yeah, a mini power shift. Yeah. There's not, but tell me the tell me the power shift. Tell me how much the power shift is. Because what I see is that last season we won the FA Cup for the record time. Tottenham didn't. Tottenham ended up high enough. They didn't win the trophy. This season we're through to the Carabao Cup final and Tottenham are ahead of us in the league but are they going to win anything? Yeah but you look at Tottenham last night they're playing Juventus away and, and we're in the Europa League playing against and we've, been in, and we've been in the Champions League for 20 years how long have Tottenham yeah, been in the Champions League? We've done nothing We've done nothing so so, what, me, so we didn't get to the final then? Okay we got to the final oh, Okay so it. we haven't done nothing then? Well, we haven't won it though. No, but we got. To, you said we did nothing, so we have done something then. Tottenham have done nothing. The thing about that is, Tottenham to me, without disrespecting them, are Johnny come lately, and I can't believe Cloud is even saying this because it's they've not, done it's nothing. Not, it's not Cloud. It's Claude. It's Claude. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm so, I'm sorry, <laughs> Claude Miles. I mean Claude. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> so, not killed him. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. So what I'm saying is that there is not. I don't think there's a mini power shift, and I'll always back the manager for what the manager has done. It's not been like. We've won it this season. I understand that. But we have got through to a final at Wembley. Yeah, fair enough, mate. I also wanted to add a comment that I've been watching the Arsenal lonely at Cholton, Steffi Mavadidi. Oh, Steffi, yeah, yeah, Steffi, Steffi. He is absolutely quality. He's running mm. rings around League One defenders. And I, I've got to say, I reckon he'll make it in Arsenal once first team one day. Well, mm. well, we hope so. We hope so. We, we're here, he's doing well. Like, I, I've, I've, I've been lucky enough to see him in under 23. And he's a, yeah. and he's a good player. And I hope, I hope I he does. I'd love, I'd love for him to stay because. Oh really? What? 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 The what, championship easily. What you you like you like him to sign fully? I'd love him to sign fully. All oh, right. <laughs> okay. Well, that's that's very kind of you. We hope he does well for Charlton, and we wish yeah. Charlton um, Let's hope they can get the best, the best, the best of luck. This year, is it? That's it. Mate, the really, really appreciate your call. Thank, thank, you. You. Cheers, thank you. Thank you, mate. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers, thank, you. Thank, thank you very much for the phone call. Great you. call, by the way. You see, Rocket Number One. That's how you talk to people. Yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> this is the, I think this is the final call we're taking tonight. Mm, Hello, welcome <laughs> to Fan Park Live. What's your name and who do you support? Right. My name's Ahmed and I support Manchester United. Good boy! Yeah, hello, sorry. Uh, anyway, back to, yeah. back to normal. Um, what do you like to say, yeah. Ahmed? My question for Ty is, what was going through your mind when you said that Arsenal lost against Watford because you were raining? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. So I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> what was going through my mind? How can the rain affect the match? Uh, for, so then, let me ask you a question. How do you know about Arsenal fan TV? What do you mean? How do I know? I was How do you know about Arsenal fan TV? Are you an Arsenal fan? Are you an Arsenal fan? But are you an Arsenal fan? No. So why no. are you watching Arsenal fan TV then? Let me ask you. Because it's free. Pardon? It's free. Because it's free. So you don't watch. Yeah. You don't watch, so you don't watch Red Man TV. I do, but still, I'm not oh, saying how can the weather affect the match? You watch, sorry, so you, watch full time, you watch full time devils. Do you watch full time devils? How can the weather affect you watch, the match? No, no, do you watch full time devils? That's irrelevant. Ask the question. Hang on, hang on. Sorry, sorry. Question. Sorry, uh, caller, I'm, I'm, I'm going to cut in because I'm going to. I want the question. I want the question to be answered. This. It doesn't matter what other YouTube channels he watch. Doesn't matter. He's a Man United fan. He's the question was why? What was going through your mind when you blamed losing to Watford on the rain? I didn't blame. Thank you, Terry. I didn't blame all of my but I don't, I don't, I don't, but what, so you're ringing up to ask me that. Yeah, you could ask me all the right. questions, you're asking me that. Yeah, and Ty, okay, Ty, tell me, yeah, if Wenger leaves, will you also leave with him, or is there Arsenal? I'm sorry, do you know who I am? Yeah, Ty. <laughs> do you know who I am? No, 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 I'm sorry, I'm not trying to leave you. Do you know who I am? You know me. Do you know me? Do you know me? Do you know me? Do you know me? Who 
Yeah. We've, no, just, no, no, we've no, just no, gone no, very no, gangster. No, 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 no. I'm not at all. I'm saying, do you know? No, because the thing is, you 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 asked me a question, I, and I don't I don't mean that. You can you can hear you can you can, you can hear you can, you can hear Claude in the bl uh, background saying uh, Miles, saying Miles. But I know no, the thing is. No, no, let me let me no, let me let me no 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 no. Hold hold hold. hold. No, hold on. You're the joker, mate. Because you rung me. So no, you're the joker. Because I said to you, no, and don't get me wrong. No, no, no. Let me. Can you let me speak, please? No, because I'm gonna do with this. Why am I say I'm not saying who I am in any famous way. I'm saying, do you know about me? Do you know who I am? Who I do? Okay, then. So if you don't know who I am, how can you then say if I Arsenal... I don't care who you are. I don't care who you are. Let me tell you something. Armin, let me tell you something. I've been an Arsenal fan longer than Arsenal has been at the club, okay? Do you know uh -huh. how, how old was you How old was you in 1992? Oh, dear, was you even born in there? Was, was you born then? Five. Okay, five. then. Yeah, I, was going, I was going games then, mate. I was going. That's not, that's I'm just saying. No, no, I was. I was going games. Then, then. So, 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 I'm not helping him and dad. Six. You, 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 you are. How's that his fault? You are. How's he? It's not his fault. His mum and dad had sex. Then. What's that got to do with anything? I'm not saying that. Well, they did have him. Is um, um, you. No, no, hold on, hold on, no, hold on, hold on. You are a Manchester United fan, and you're trying to question me about my loyalty for the club. Have you ever been to Old Trafford? Yeah. How many times? Like five. I've been there five hundred times. All right. Yes, I have. Yes, I have, my friend. Yes, I have. I've been going since 1992. Hang on. Claude and Ty, I'm a question. So the thing is, you cannot question You cannot question my allegiance to the club. All right, all right, all right. You're ringing up to ask me that. Worry about your own club, my friend. Worry about your own club, my friend. Okay. Worry about your own club. Worry about your own club. I can do good. 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 Okay, mate. so, so oh my God. Cal calculate. I, I had to Google that, but I just wanted to check. Okay, mate. So calculate how many times from 1993 to now. I've gone to I've gone to more games Old Trafford than you, and I'm an Arsenal fan. Yeah, but what's so that? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Sorry, sorry. Let me, let me bring this all back. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's Ahmed, nasty. sorry. One second. That, it, it doesn't, that doesn't matter. That doesn't matter. This is nasty. Yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. It's not nasty. He's the one that tries to call me Tight, tight, tight. Stop a second. Fans in Singapore that watch every game. More, you're a bigger fan than them because you've been going to Arsenal. Are you Ahmed now? Listen, can, can we all just stop talking one second? I'm, 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 Ahmed, Ahmed, I'm, I'm, Ahmed, Ahmed, one sec, oh, mate, one sec. I want to I want to bring this back. I want to bring this back a second. Can you can you answer Ahmed's first question? Because one thing I would say about you tonight, Ty, I've got me really well. You haven't answered anybody's question. I have answered. You haven't. What was going? What made you blame the rain? What, what, the, the, I said what I think. And, what, and I said what I think, and that's it. I said everyone is taught to say what I think. I said what I think. Nothing was going through my mind. It's, I said what I think. Yeah. What was going through Alex Ferguson's mind when he said that the match United players couldn't see each other because of the kids? What about that? What about that? What about that? What about that? Ahmed, what about that? Ahmed, anything else? Ahmed, 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 I understand your. your yeah, of course you, you do. You, yeah. Of course you, you want do. the question thank answered. You yes, no answer. Yeah, thank you, yeah. I think what and happened. Good. Now, I'm what happened? Yeah. No, I can answer it for you. No, you can't. You're okay. not me. I'll answer yeah. it. You're let, not let, me. Let Claude speak, please. I'll answer it. Well, when the water goes in your eyes, yeah, it can affect you. <laughs> exactly, like a female linesman. Right. And you can also slag off a female linesman when she's <laughs> invigilated, can't you? What? Why, what's it got to do with a female linesman? No, because that's what he said. I have one more question, eh? If you had the choice, oh. would you stop, um, would you stop Diego Simeone for Arsene Wenger or not? Or would you, would you, would you keep Arsene Wenger? Would you swap Simeone for Arsene Wenger? Wenger? I don't know. Why don't you answer the question, Armin? Because you seem to know me. You answer it for me. Okay, I would say Diego Simeone because Wenger is just a shit manager. That's, a, that's Ahmed, the reality. There we go. Ahmed, 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 we really appreciate your call. Ridiculous, Ahmed. Just, listen, thanks, tight, tight. Thanks for good boy. He's, he's gone. He's gone. What, 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 please watch Redman TV. He's already gone. Sorry, um, full time devils. No, no, send him to the football terrace or the United Stand, please. <laughs> oh, yeah, and, the, and, the, and those two as well. I can't believe what, what kind of questions are these. A Manchester United fan is going to ring up and ask me that. Yes. Why? Why? Because why? Listen, do you want, can I tell you why, Ty? And, and why? I'm not speaking for him. Do you know why? Because Arsenal fan TV is bigger than Arsenal in terms of it's got no, wide. It's not, not, than no, a no, no, club. no, no, no. Listen, let me finish talking. You don't let people finish and you no, start talking and you. And you let me, no, I didn't say that. It's okay. not what I was going to say. Let me finish yeah, speaking. Go on, go on. It's bigger than Arsenal in terms of it's broader than the Arsenal fan base. There are people that don't even watch football that watch Arsenal fan TV. Yeah, so firstly, Robbie probably wouldn't appreciate you telling non-Arsenal fans not to watch it. 
first and foremost. I was going to say, not watch And it. listen, everybody, watch whether you support TV. Basingstoke, no. Man United, Arsenal, or Shanghai Noon, whoever, it doesn't matter. You're allowed an opinion on football. Do you know why people are asking you questions, Ty? Because they, they're asking you questions because they watch your videos. You're an influencer on, on, on YouTube. You're, on, you're part of the biggest football influencer YouTube channel in the world. So people that want to understand what's going on in your mind. And the irony is, you get angry with people for calling you deluded and judging your mindset, yep. but then you won't answer people's question about your mindset. So people will make their well, own minds up. It's down to your... It's your what they want then. No, they can't because you get angry about it. What so I'm angry for, about is the way people are coming across. Because you won't answer questions. You've but, deflected every on. single question but, but, tonight. What did, he, what did Ahmed say? He said, what was going through your mind? Why yeah. didn't you ask... Instead of saying, why didn't you say that? What's, what do you mean, what's going through my mind? There's nothing wrong with my mind. My mind is clear. No one says anything wrong with you. That's what no, I'm asking. No, but, no, but the thing is, it's the way the question is phrased, Terry. It's okay. the way the question is All phrased. Right. Okay, but, you, you, but you've got to sometimes take away the way it's phrased and look at what no, people are meaning yeah, by it. People, no. people can't understand you giving that excuse. So they want to know why you said it. Well, there's, and, a lot of, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of things in the world we can't understand. That's life, isn't it? I say what I think. Okay, cool. I say what I think. But listen, ladies and gentlemen, it, for yeah, me... Thanks very much for all the calls. Sorry if um, I'm being... An, uh, I got annoyed and all that, but what I will say is that I don't appreciate... People being rude, I don't appreciate that. I don't appreciate that because gonna bring up if you're gonna, if you, if, 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 if oh, oh yeah, yeah. About listen, I, I, I need to do one one last thing. We need to bring up, and, oh, and yeah, I'm gonna put to you. So Please when we had Mr. DT and, and obviously Robbie in here, and, thank you, thanks for And you wanted to bring this up. We talked about earlier about uh, the story. Well, I had to. After the story what DT about said. DT saying that you were late to a game not by only that, X not amount, only that. amount of minutes on your way to West Ham away when they were still down Green Street, and you said you were late because you were on a bus. No, I never said that. And the reason you were late is because you didn't want to get off the bus and walk down the street because no. you'd paid for the bus ride to take you to the stadium. Which is not true. What, can you tell us what happened? Can you tell us I your own you, words? I can tell you what happened in the three instances. And I could take... First of all, I'm not deranged. That doesn't make any sense. I'm not deranged. So, I'm not saying, I'm not saying it for him at all. And the first one is he said about the bus, he said about the mascot, and there's something else he said, which I can't remember now. About your shoes. So, no, the, shoe, I don't, the shoes are irrelevant. Whatever I wear is whatever I wear. That, I don't even care about the shoes. Now, he wasn't being rude about that. He was saying how dedicated you are to the club and so was Robbie. And then they both yeah. said that. What I would say, and they, Rob, they both said how Robbie, amazingly dedicated you are to the football club. Yeah, Rob, Robbie said that. And Robbie was saying that I'm um, a nice person and um, feelings mutual, Robbie. Don't worry, Robbie, your check's in the post, yeah. So anyway, but yeah, yeah, Robbie's a lovely person. But the thing is, with the bus one, that doesn't make any sense. Why would I be a mile to the ground, like DT said, and not get off the bus? I never told him that at all. I never told him that at all. That just didn't happen. And with the one with the mascot, I, I saw, actually, I saw... Th so you're saying DT's a liar? I'm not saying that at all. <laughs> I'm only winding up. I'm, I'm no, being devil's advocate. I'm, sorry, I'm, sorry. I'm not, I'm not saying that at all. I'm, I'm a just... Channel 4 news reporter moment. So what you're saying No, is... but you don't have to apologise, Terry, because you're not the one who said it. DT's the one who said it. What I'm saying is that didn't happen. Now, I'm not calling him a liar. I'm saying he's got his wires crossed. crossed. We can all do that. Ah. And the one with the mascot one is even a different... Oh, yeah, sorry. And he said about the Watford one as well. Now, with the mascot one, he was saying that I was saying... I, he's, it's true what he said. I said, would you say that tomorrow? He said, I was saying, yeah, yeah. I wasn't aggressive at all. It was, it was at half time against West Ham, we conceded, to, we were turning up and cruising, and we conceded two stupid goals to Andy Carroll. So the West Ham mascot was coming across now, and they was the West Ham mascot was doing that, and I thought that was unnecessary, because what it can lead to is incitement. And I thought that was unnecessary, so I just said, I said to him. Oh, you can you imagine it? <laughs> <laughs> that, the London riots were started by a man dressed as a hammer. No, 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 no. No, 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 I'm not saying that. What I'm saying, no, I'm not having a I'm, I'm, de I'm, de I'm, deadly, I'm deadly serious. I thought it was just, because the thing is, if, 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 if he's, he's suddenly laughing now, you weren't laughing when you was raising up your blood pressure, was you? The thing about it is, with... Can I ask you a question about the, 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 bus, the bus one quickly? Yeah, go because on. we got to end. Were you late to the game? I was late to the game. Why? Because the bus got stuck in, it's got stuck in traffic. That's so you, why. So you, didn't get up, so you didn't get off and walk? Walk to where? How could I walk? If, if I was near the ground, I would have. Oh, okay. You, so you were really far from the ground. Yeah. If, if, That's what I'm trying to add to the time. I need exactly. the facts here. I it like does, facts. It doesn't, it doesn't make any sense if, tube, I'm, I'm, if I'm a mile away. <laughs> there but is a tube. But back, back, to, back to the mascot one. Now, what I say, because the thing is, it was it, the goals have just happened. So you are there now going like that to fans now when they just conceded a goal. Now, we all know football is a very, very emotive, passionate game. You, we definitely know where you. Yeah, and him as well. Yeah, He's the one that's really yeah, exactly. But what I'm saying is that I thought, I didn't think the West Ham mascot should do that. So I said to, the, I said to him, or her, it's probably him, would you do that to, would you do that to me? And that was it. 
There was even a video on there. Ty has arrived with the mascot. And all it was was I said to them, would you do that to me? And that was it. So I don't know what, we don't know what the big round was. The third one now, about arguing with Watford fans. Now, I wouldn't say I was arguing. We was having a football debate. Can, can you not debate? We're debating about football. That's it. Cool. Ty, thank you very much for yeah. clearing up those points to us. Um, and, and Claude as well. Thank you very thank much you. tonight. But um, DT's a liar, according to um, this man. On my no, I didn't, say, I, didn't, I didn't say that. Would you all agree that he said that? Yeah, I, think I never said DT's a liar. DT versus Ty. I didn't, yeah. I didn't, I didn't say DT's a liar. I could take, Mate, I, 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 no, I, look, we're only messing. We're only playing. Yeah, no, I don't, I, don't mind I Mate, don't mind taking DT's quality verbally. night you as ever. Verbally, verbally. Verbally. Thanks, oh, we had to specify yeah. that. Thank you, Terry. But, one, but Terry, let me, let me offer an apology. Nice I'm sorry if I was a bit out of order. No. You, you're I'm, cool, bro. I'm sorry about cutting fans off, but what, what I'm serious about is the thing is, again, I appreciate it. No, no, I appreciate it that no, people know who we are <laughs> and what we do. That's very, very um, great. But when people coming up, please be not. I want to say just please be respectful. Cool. That's what I'm saying. Is that, is that wrong for me to say That's that? That's cool, mate. It's great. Listen, thank you all for tuning in as thank ever. You very much. Make sure you smash that like button. Make sure you hit the subscribe button as well. This has been Fan Park Live. Make sure you download the One Football app. All the information for that we'll is in the description below. We'll oh, wait, again. we are doing this again. And one last thing before we go. Do you know who he is? Yeah. Who am I? Who am I? Do you know me? I Thank forgot you. to say about the Thank you. I forgot to say the one about Robbie.